Hi, I'm meteorologist TJ Del Santo with a quick web update for you this evening. Live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar. We're not tracking anything. It's fairly quiet. Our threat tracker for tonight, Sunday and Monday remaining at that low level. However, we are watching the potential for some light snow showers Sunday night and into Monday. If it becomes a little bit more than snow showers, we might have to raise that up to the medium level for that Sunday night, Monday time frame. Hurricane barrier cam. We've got lots of clouds around right around sunset. A little pinkish hue to the sky. Live picture from Narragansett. We got some clouds, a little bit of sunshine. There's that weather system that blew on by earlier in the day. Nor'easter working its way off to our south and east and now working into the Canadian Maritimes away from us. Our skies will be clearing during the overnight. We have another weather system following on the heels of that one that's way up there. Down here near uh, Texas and Louisiana picking up moisture from the Gulf of Mexico. This is going to be working its way on off to our south and east, but it could come close enough that we see some snow showers tomorrow night. Let's take a look at it with our future cast. Here we are tomorrow morning with our skies clearing out, taking you into Sunday midday. We'll start off with sunshine, but clouds take over throughout the afternoon. Here we are around five o'clock Sunday evening. It looks like we'll still be dry, but after that we could actually see a period of snow showers. I'll say between seven and uh, nine p.m. or so they should leave and then we may actually find some more snow showers around from a system diving down out of Canada Monday morning. Then it gets really cold. We'll talk about that in just a little bit with my seven day future cast for tonight. Continued clearing cold and dry overnight low temperatures around 30 degrees dry this evening and dry during the overnight hours. Here's what your Sunday looks like. We'll start off with some sunshine, but then the clouds will tend to thicken up a little bit. High temperatures around 38. It'll be dry during the day through the daylight hours, but after again at about seven o'clock or so we run the risk of some snow showers and obviously if uh, we have some snow showers around the roads, could be slick in some spots. Best chance for that probably along the south coast. Here's your live pinpoint Doppler 12 seven day future cast. Now on Monday we get the chance for some snow showers here, uh, mainly during the morning hours. The afternoon I think will be clearing out. It'll be windy and much colder. Look at the high only around 28 degrees Monday afternoon, 10 to 15 degrees below average for the high temperatures on Monday. It remains cold for Tuesday, Wednesday and uh, Thursday and Friday. All these temperatures are below average. Then we we look ahead into Saturday and then we have the potential of another storm system. It could be a snowstorm, but it's a long way away, something that we're monitoring. And the reason why we're not overly confident about what's going to come is because the energy is basically on the other side of the world. The energy is just coming off of Japan and still has to cross the Pacific Ocean and work its way across the United States before we know exactly what it'll do. But there are some indications that we could be seeing something uh, a week from uh, today. However, until then, no major storm systems, just a lot of cold through the next seven days.